We now have the video that shows the moments before a Hartford police officer ended up shooting and killing a suspect on Monday. It was a shootout in the middle of the day. Channel 3 Eyewitnesses reported Luke Hydash is live outside Hartford Police Headquarters. Luke, break down what we're about to see. Wendell, Nicole, not only do we have that video, we have also learned the names of both the suspect and the officer involved in this shootout. Let's go ahead and show you that video now. Two different angles to show you this morning, and in those videos, you see the officer, right now identified as Brian Sullivan. He even drops his clip, and he's able to regain it, and he is able to hit 44-year-old Jamie Grant, who took off after shooting at Sullivan first. University of New Haven law enforcement expert Ken Gray, he has studied this video. He says Sullivan likely shot at Grant as he was running away to keep the rest of the city safe. That he may be fleeing to try to find cover to try to continue to engage the officer, so a threat to the office, potential threat to the officer. But the other thing is that he still got the gun in his hand, he just shot at the officer, and that there are other people potentially in the area that may also be at risk. It's, it's frightening, it really is. I mean, to think that uh, a person would... Um, you know, just uh, just fire at a fire at a, just jump out of the car and, and start firing at, at, at anybody, particularly a police officer. It's just it's a frightening thing. This entire exchange lasts only about 20 seconds. We're talking Monday afternoon, right around 2 o'clock on Barber Street. Officer Solomon, he is on paid administrative leave this morning. That is protocol as the Office of Inspector General investigates. We're live in Hartford this morning. Luke Hydash, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. All right, thanks, Luke. Also,